Okay, hello everybody. Um, playing Amnesia again. This is, I think, th yeah, it's third night in a row I'm playing it. Um, each filming one part, so I'll keep in suit and do it again. Um, this is going to be the last time I'm going to be able to record for a while. Because um, the reason why I'm able to record so late is because my uh, dad is away on a business trip. So, um, you can't hear me because his room is like literally right next to mine and he can hear like everything I say so after this I won't be able to record anymore for a little bit unfortunately ooh what's this <gasps> oh my god I probably should not have done that oh okay huh Literatures for noobs. Okay, we should probably get serious here. It's a horror game, not a comedy. I seem to remember that there should be something here. I got up. I heard something in my room. Okay, now I'm just letting it get to me. Alright, let's try not to let that get to me. And we can keep going. Okay, I don't like any of the sounds that are coming into my ears right now. Oop. That's like this. Oh, that's a bright light. Oh, what a waste. Alright, sorry I have to talk so soft. I noticed that. Oh, God. Oh, crap. I just think Daniel's freaking out. Oop, yeah, Daniel is freaking out. Um, sorry I have to talk so soft, um, I just don't want my sister to come into my room and beat the living hell out of me for <laughs> waking her up. She's older, by the way, so she'll probably be able to do that. And I have no doubt in my mind that she will. So, that's why we must keep our voices down. <gasps> okay, that's kind of freaky. Okay, okay. Come on, don't do that. Don't do that. Run, 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 run as fast as you can. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I don't want to go anywhere, please don't make me go anywhere. <gasps> Almost had a lantern oil. I don't want to go. I don't want to go anywhere. I don't need my lantern, really. Um, what's down here? Please don't scare me anymore. Please, have I already been down here? I can't remember. I'm, I might have been thinking about... Oh, I think I have. Yeah, I think I have. Okay, I should probably stop running. Um, keep going in, in and out of a whisper, which is kind of inconsistent, and I apologize. You'll need that at the moment. I can see perfectly fine. I'm perfectly okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I think it's good that I'll get a break because I think that this game is really <gasps> blood, 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 
blood. Lots of blood. Let's take a break here, Daniel. Blood. And that's not part of the nightmare either. That's like real blood. Why? <gasps> Lantern oil. Wait, what was that? <gasps> what is that sound? Oh, cockroaches. Oh, this really sucks. I can't play the piano. It's kind of dumb. Oh, God, I'll stop whispering. That's not good for you. Oh, shit. Maps. I remember. I don't want to waste my time on that. Okay. Let's go over here. gonna be okay. Whoa, Daniel. It's okay, Daniel. It's okay. It's okay. 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. It's impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling to safety, and grasped Firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. That's kind of creepy and weird. Well, not creepy, more weird than creepy. Come on, Daniel, it's okay. Stop, stop freaking out. Oops, what's my mental health? I have a slight headache. I'm afraid I'm going to run out of lantern oil. Then I'll be really screwed. So that's why I'm trying to light candles and stuff. Kingdom of Prussia. Central Prussia. Okay, I'm just gonna rush to this end. The light is... Ew, this is severely helpful. Severely helpful. I don't know why you wouldn't want to put it in your lantern. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Hmm. So it looks like they knew this nightmare thing would be coming after them. Like it is now, and they decide to get ready for it. Ooh, a tinderbox. Okay, I can feel my actual floor kind of rumbling, which is kind of scary. I won't 
longer, I'm not gonna lie. Fragile, but not breakable by hand. Oh, yeah. I did this part, like, this is kind of where I ended, but, um, I might have said that before, but this is, I did this, but you just have to keep looking. Stupid. I'm gonna miss the leading game. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. So what we gotta do is we gotta pull those books out. And then we've done it. And we got all those. But I don't know how to get that page out, because I know you're supposed to be able to read it. Because it's flashing like that, but... It's baffling me. Alright, what's in here? <gasps> A key! <gasps> Don't hurt me, please. Okay. That might be somewhere I could hide later on. And don't worry, I haven't played this entire- Oh! Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they'll all rot for all, or they can rot for all I care. Maybe I'll feed them some wine. It would, in a sense, solve both of my problems. Hmm. Might find some shady things in the wine cellar. But, since the last two parts were kind of long and I don't really like to put you guys through too much, might leave it at, at that. Just check down here. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it at that. And then we can venture into the unknown past this door and the wine cellar next episode. Um, what are we time for here? I should... Ah! Okay, yeah, we got like 13 minutes or so. You know what, we can look past here a little bit. Wait, where we are you here? I have a sneaking suspicion we're already here. something moving. Okay, don't, don't freak out, Daniel. It's okay. It's gonna be alright. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of getting freaked out. So, <laughs> let's just leave it at now. And we can venture off into the unknown later. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure you leave a comment and tell me what you think, or if you have any suggestions, or if you think I've missed anything, then uh, I'll go and look at it, or if you want more of these, or whatever you want, just make sure you leave a comment, because I don't know what you guys want, unless you tell me. I know some of you are leaving comments, and I thank you for that. But until next time, guys, um, thanks for watching, and see you later.